What is going on guys? Triggs here. And wow, I have been wanting to play this game for quite some time. Obviously you can tell down here I've uh, played around with the prologue a little bit. Um, trying to just, you know, get ready for uh, some recording. Um, I also have a bunch of information about the, uh, the people that I'm going to be playing. But we're going to be doing a campaign. Total War Rome 2. Uh, we're not going to be playing Rome, though. I do have the DLC pack, and you can probably guess really quick who I'm going to play. I'm extremely excited. I I just... I I wanted to post a lot more Minecraft videos, um, and then I got this game, and I started playing it a little bit, trying to just familiarize with everything. Uh, and then I got a beta key for a certain MMO that's coming out in the future and I am super excited to play that oh my gosh um, but yeah so let's see here we're gonna be doing a new campaign and no we are not playing Rome this is actually gonna be extremely hard because uh, <laughs> we're gonna be starting off with one city that's right we're playing Sparta we're doing Sparta kicks up in this bizich and this is going to be some hard stuff. Uh, initial challenge says hard. Yes, it is going to be hard. Uh, the year is 272 BC. By then, Sparta was basically fucked, uh, to say the least. Uh, they started to expand, and they got anally raped because of it. Um, unfortunately... Uh, in in Total War, Rome Two or any Total Wars, you can't just say, "Hey, be my bitch," "Hey, be my bitch," "Hey, be my," to everyone. You have to expand. You have to start taking and conquering everything. Uh, you can uh, subjugate um, and and make like I guess city states or whatever, but all it does is it gives you a little bit of money. And that's it. Like, barely anything. It's not even worth doing, really. So, on top of it, you can't even build troops there. I was thinking about just staying with Sparta and then freaking subjugating as much as I can. And just hold true to the Spartan ways of when they were amazing. But, unfortunately, that's not going to happen. So, uh, we are not going to show AI moves. Uh, we'll leave the advisor help high, just so you guys can, like, can see it. Uh, battle time. Well, we're definitely not doing realism because I'm not the greatest. Uh, we are going to do some battles. We're not going to do every battle just because uh, it gets kind of annoying and I'm also not the greatest. I am a lot better than I was when I first started though, so that is good. Um, let's see, go down here. We're going to do military victory, so control 140 settlements either by direct ownership or through client states and military allies. So you can become military allies with a whole bunch of people, yay. Uh, but I don't know if we're going to completely go all out and just take over 140 by ourselves. We'll see. Um... But you have to completely uh, control the following six provinces, either by direct ownership or through client states and military allies. So the same as right here. Uh, Hellas, Macedonia, Italia, Syria, Persia. Yes, per wait. Persis, sorry, not Persia. Uh, it might be the same thing. I don't know. Oh, these names are so hard. I hate them. Uh Three strict, uh, maintain 180 <laughs> units in total. Well, by the time you get here, I hope you have 180 units. So, let me just check, make sure the AI moves is not shown. It takes forever. There are so many people in this game, or, uh, I guess, cultures. There's so many. It takes forever to load. Definitely campaign mode. Holy moly, I just clicked that again. Let me make sure it's the same. Perfect. So, 272 BC, military victory, Sparta. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. I don't know what I'm going to do. 
All right, so the loading screen from hell. Everything takes forever to load in this game, but I guess it's expected. There's a lot going on. Uh, we are going to have Sparta Talk. That's right, I'm bringing Sparta Talk to this Mammer Jammer. Uh, basically, I'm just going to talk about Sparta, uh, about their history. Yeah, we'll go into the whole 300 thing, which wasn't really 300 men. There was more, but yeah, we're going to go into a little bit of everything. The people of Epirus are fools. Having utterly failed to conquer Rome, they crawl back and presume to conquer Greece. To try is not to win. They will know this when you meet them in battle. Macedon may join you, but they are no better than the rest. Alexander's conquests have left them with delusions of grandeur. They will be checked as will every other aggressor. You may fare better working with Athens and other true Greek states, but history has often taught otherwise. Ultimately, trust only in Sparta, and you will prevail. That's right. Trust in, in Sparta, by myself, screw everyone else. So we have 6,000 in the treasury already. Uh, that's going to go extremely fast. That sucks. But, it's you know, it's still a war. So, let's see here. Um, our new objective that has been issued is completely control two provinces, either by direct ownership or through the normal BS. Uh, there's some wisdom shit. Perfect. Wow. Here we are. So here is Sparta. My mouse is going extremely slow. This is great. Yay. So we got some hopolites. We got general. Let's, oh, I'm clicking on all sorts of shizzle. Oh my gosh. What is wrong with my mouse all of a sudden? It's going so slow. There we go. It's back. We are back. <laughs> all right. So we got some fortitude. All right. There's our general. And that's his army. This looks like an awesome emblem. That is going to be our freaking emblem. We have two armies, it looks like. So in the first one, we have like 10 people. 10 people. Ready for battle. Commander. Okay. So we don't have any cavalry, of course. Uh, it does look like we're at war with the uh, Greyhound State, and uh, Athens is a, uh, let's see, Ooh. If the faction's initial offer or demand isn't quite what you had in mind, you can use the counter-offer option to enable further negotiation to take place, rather than simply rejecting it. All right. So we're trading with Athens. Sweet. So we can become allies with them pretty easily. Most likely, uh, Mastodon, defensive allies, they're neutral towards us, even though we're defensive allies. That sounds sweet. We are at war with Epirus. Screw them. They're hostile. Uh, they also have a port, so my mouse is <laughs> being great again. Um, let's see. Okay, so let's uh, let's go ahead and move the mouse. And let's see here. Herding ground or farm. So four food, six food, health, or wealth. It's 80 wealth. We need a lot of wealth, but we're also going to need lots of food. So... <sighs> Going with food. We're going with food on that end. And then uh we don't wanna buy too much stuff. We don't wanna do too much at once. Cause we need a pooptastic ton of uh troops. Because we're Sparta and that's how we roll. So let's see. Okay, well um Mm-hmm. <laughs> Does anyone know what I'm looking at? Alright, so... Okay, this is what we need to do. Nope. 
this is this is the button. This is the button I'm looking for. Okay. So let's see. Ambition two two one three. Uh, this is the person we have to worry about the most, and he's our general. Whatever. So. Oh. Okay. Well. Um. I think we're good for now. Uh, marriage, I heard, is expensive as poop. Yep. That's never going to happen. We'll just die off in battle. That's how we roll. Screw it. Uh, and then we have one bunch of crap. Okay, perfect. So let's build some troops. Uh, this guy looks cooler, but he has less. So we're going to go with this guy. Nope. Okay, um, we can't even build any of the hopolites. Uh, well, Spartan hopolites. So these are the only Spartan hopolites we're gonna have probably for quite a while. So that sucks. We're gonna go uh, pikemen or spears for forty. Uh, let's, if you right click, it'll show you like their melee attack and everything. So let's see. So I clicked on these guys. These guys are the uh, free type of, they're not really Spartans. They kind of just live there. That's how they roll. So weapon damage 40, melee attack 21, and 45 melee defense. 20, 40, 48. Eight. So they have more defense, but I mean, like, really, they're not. They're not bad. These guys have a lot more armor. They don't look like they have a lot more armor. Twenty-one. So they don't do as much damage, but they have more armor. Holy seventy! Did I not see that right? No, I'm sorry. Melee defense. Forty-eight. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna keep clicking on all these. Clack! Alright, we're going with these guys. Sign up, lads! So it looks like I think we have like three barracks. Yeah. So we can build three troops at a time. Also, cool thing, uh, you don't have to be like in a city or anything. Um, you can just recruit right from here. Uh, and you can also uh, hire mercenaries. So... Yeah, it's just instantly just adding them to your army. So that's pretty cool. Um, should we go for the uh, the the Greyhound state? I think we might. Um, I have a feeling we're gonna be in war pretty soon. Let's uh, you know what? We're gonna add a few of those. We're just gonna build our army. We're not messing around. Oh, uh, we need technology. Okay. So, uh, it's either uh, civic or logistics at the beginning. So, um, we're going to need this, but... <sighs> yeah, we're doing this first. That's just how it's going to be. All right. So, I'm not sure. I Like I said before, I've been playing with the uh, show the other moves, so I'm not sure how long this is going to take after ending a turn. Yeah, this is going to take a bit. This is going to be fun. Anyway, so we can talk about, I guess, the little Spartans um, from the beginning. So, a uh, long, long time ago in the BC era, the Spartans... Um, they became to be, I, I don't know all the history when they first started, uh, but from what I understand, um, they started out fairly normal, like normal people would, and then they slowly started going towards more of a, uh, um, I guess, militaristic type of state and making their guys awesome. Uh... Oh, cool. We can suggest targets, I guess. We got all of our people. We even got a trait. Sweet. 
So yeah, they uh, they became very militaristic. They thought it would be an awesome idea to train from almost birth. They don't train from exactly birth. They do let the uh, the mothers take care of the kids or the boys for a little while, but they do take care of the girls for uh, until well, they get married by the boys. Um, it is all arranged marriage, so it's good. It also is not good which you will see, um, but we're still building there, and this is, I need, need the required research, so this will be the first one. Um, yeah, so, f I mean, we hunger for battle. should I, uh, should, should I go for it? They're still training? Ready for battle. Oh, I guess you can't Ready train two at once in the same, uh, maybe province area. Hellas, Hellas province. We need to take over this area. Excuse me, I'm dying here. I'm kind of hungry. So let's see. Um, we are going to we're going to take these guys because they're awesome. And we are going to go here. Ready for battle. Uh, what I think is dumb is that right there. Finding shelter. Yeah. Uh, it should only be, you should only be able to go up, like, these type of areas. Like, where it's kind of like sea level, you know? Not like a huge ass cliff. But I guess you can kind of say that we did that. Uh, they have a few units. We, we have, have more suckers. Uh, we're going to take, this is like our, uh, our, like, spy chick. She's a... Uh, She's pretty awesome. She's gonna go kill some some peeps. So that's how she rolls. We're gonna go straight to here. Uh, oh, I did not want to do that. Oh crap! Over here, woman. Um. Okay. So either. So it looks like poison is the most either sabotage their provisions. Or attempt to assassinate. This one's a little bit cheaper. <laughs> I'm already going. I'm going Spartan Jew, by the way. Going straight Spartan Jew. So let's see. We're gonna we're gonna try that. Let's see what happens. Sabotage failed. You suck. She should just die. Okay. Um, I mean, basically, we're done. That's when those two are going to be up, so we will just end the turn. So yeah, um, the they decided it would be a good idea to uh, train from childbirth, basically. Uh, the whole thing in like the 300 movie where they would take the children, inspect them, throw them off a cliff, completely true. Completely messed up, but completely true. I mean, they wanted a superior army, and it freaking worked. It worked. Um, so they, by age, well, when they hit age seven, they're basically taken and put into an, an academy, uh, per se, um, and they would basically start training, uh, a lot of athletics, um, they'd be taught all sorts of goodies, uh, from their teachers and everything, and I just moved my mouse away from the screen, there we go, yeah, uh, age 7 to 12, they would, uh, be taught, uh, they'd be beaten, and, uh, basically they'd be, just be taught everything they know, um, up to age, well, up to age 12, they'd also be punished by the other boys, like, uh, the other guys, the, so basically the older you are, you can punish the people below you, so, uh, the older boys would beat the crap out of the little kids, and kind of just beat them into, uh, learning. Uh, your agent was not successful. By the effort was not entirely wasted. You learn more about their failures than you would otherwise have done. Cool. 
Uh, Electra, an agent was exposed. Forces found concealing for an agent. Yep. There's agents everywhere. Never going to find them all. Um, cool. So, let's see. We can already start a village. We are doing marble, so we are exporting marble. Um, is it either one or the other? Barracks. We're going to go ahead and go to technology and we're going to learn that. Um, I, I guess. Oh. Let's see. This will be. Um, oops. Jesus, why do I keep pressing the escape button? Uh, manipulation. Everything's basically uh, 50 50, so we're going to try to kill her. By. We're going to poison. We want to poison. We're doing poison. We failed. She sucks. Like, major. Horrible. <laughs> like, that's, that's how much she sucks. We're going to go and stop right here. Yes, that's all. Uh, we're also going to not train anyone, looks like. But we are going to train some Hopolite free men. Oh, I didn't even realize <laughs> this right there. Um, what? These guys are way better. More armor, more morale, less melee defense, but they got more armor. Alright, we're just gonna go all out. Um, pfft, let's see. I think it's either one or the other, which sucks, because now I don't know. So, we are going to. Um, are we gonna pause it here? It has been over 20 minutes. Uh,. I'm going to pause it here. Um, Spartan Talk will continue uh, next episode. Uh, obviously, right now we're stopped at the point where the 12-year-olds uh, pick on everyone else. So after, uh, yeah, we'll be back and we will continue. Uh, and I think we're going to go kill a Greyhound. <laughs> That's what's up. And our, uh, our spy is going to just die because she sucks at life. So I will talk to you guys later. Peace.